All right, so this is the engine from the Fordson Major that I got with the dozer blade. Uh, it's incomplete, missing a heap of parts. Injector pump's a big one right there, starter motor. It's been sitting around for a while. Um, I figured it's time we pull it down and film it as we go. A bit of a learning curve for me too. I've uh, never pulled one down as much as I'm about to do on this one. We'll go step by step. Uh, my aim is to uh, practice replacing the head gasket because on my other running major I've noticed a little bead of coolant is coming out of the head gasket. So I'm going to knock that on the head real early and, and replace it. So might as well practice on a donor engine, so to speak. So first things first, the rocker cover removal. Uh, nothing too hard about this one. Um, so we've got, this is the two bolt version. There is another version, it's a six bolt version and all the bolts are down here. Most engine gasket replacement kits come with both gaskets for the two hole and the six hole gaskets on the rocker cover. So to begin with, first thing first is to loosen this adapter nut on this side. Two bolts come out and then the bolt that holds the decompression lever on this side undo, take the decompression lever out and then it should be as easy as give it a wiggle, everything's come loose There we go, rocker cover off. There's the inside, mm, bit of heat, bit of oil thrown around. Beautiful. There's our cork gasket. If you're going to pull it apart, I would strongly suggest you replace all the gaskets as you go. Like I said, you can get complete engine gasket kits. I just picked up one, it was delivered off eBay in three days and it cost me a whopping 70 Australian dollars. All right, first video of what's gonna be a few videos of pulling the Fordson Major engine apart. Start with the rocker cover and work our way down. All right, see you at the next one.